ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 8th Emerging India Awards. Your host for the evening, Sumera Abedi. A famous man once said that God gives us dreams a size too big so that we can grow in them. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to ICICI Bank and CNBC TV 18's Emerging India Awards 2013, powered by Chrysler. Today, we are recognizing SMEs that have dared to dream big. We are felicitating those entrepreneurs that have moved out of their comfort zone to achieve new heights and are honoring those small businesses that have stood strong in this last year of economic turmoil. ICICI Bank has been our partners in this inspiring journey of the Emerging India Awards since its inception. Our next speaker is the head of this bank and she is here to tell us how SMEs can overcome their challenges to emerge bigger and stronger. Please welcome the MD and CEO of ICICI Bank, Chanda Kochar. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Let me, on behalf of ICICI Bank, thank each one of you for being here with us today at this awards function. This is the eighth Emerging India Awards. And as I was traveling to these awards, I was just thinking to myself that in these eight years, the entire SME sector, and in a way the entire Indian economy, has come a full circle. The SMEs have a very special role to play in the development of an economy. While they are probably the first ones to face challenges, it's also un believed and seen that they are probably the first ones to start the path of recovery as well. India is currently facing some short-term and medium-term challenges, uh, and we need to take a lot of steps to address these challenges and to realize our growth potential for the long term. And let me today wish the entire SME community all the very best so that they can not just grow themselves, but in a way lead the growth and prosperity of India. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, let's put the spotlight now on the hottest SMEs in India with the Emerging India Awards 2013. These awards will be handed out in seven vertical and nine horizontal categories. Let's take a look at the nominees. And here's a look at the nominees in the next category this evening, the education category. Education, Calorix Education and Research Foundation, Sri Ram Swaroop Memorial Group, Kushal Education Trust. Well, if India has to make the most of its demographic dividend, it is essential that the workforce coming out of its colleges hasn't just acquired bookish knowledge, but instead are ready to work trained professionals. And that is what the winner in this category, Kushal Education Trust, accomplishes. from the chief guest this evening. Mr. Murthy, I'm going to request you to please take the podium and tell us the story of how a group of IT engineers actually created a world-class institution. A very good evening to every one of you. From my own journey, I have realized that the primary role of, a, of an entrepreneur, of a leader, is to enhance the aspirations of your people. You have to give them confidence to reach for the stars. Second, you have to inspire these people in their hour of confusion, dilemma, and tribulation. Third, I have realized that there are six time invariant and context invariant attributes for success of any institution. And they are openness to new ideas, meritocracy, values, speed, imagination or innovation and excellence in execution. 
As long as every one of you embrace these six ideas, I believe that you will succeed. One important thing I have, I must say, and that is, at some point of time, you will get listed. But even if you're not listed, you have investors. So therefore, remember that your task as the CEO is to bring bad news to your investors early and proactively. That's why I always say, let the bad news take the elevator and let the good news take the steps. So as long as you are willing to be open to bring bad news to your investors, then they will trust you. And if they trust you, you can take bold and tough decisions. So therefore, please do not hesitate to bring bad news to the set of investors that you have. Well, thank you very much for this opportunity. I am truly honored to be amongst people who will create uh, India of the future. And I congratulate CNBC TV 18 for, and of course ICICI Bank and Crystal for creating a platform where we honor and applaud such SME entrepreneurs. Thank you very much. Well, congratulations once again. And let me also invite on stage all our winners, all our presenters and the jury to please come up on stage for a quick photo walk. And before we end this evening, here's a big thank you to all our sponsors for their continuous and unwavering support. Our presenting sponsor, ICICI Bank, Business Banking, powered by Crystal, Exchange Partner, NSC's SME platform, Emerge, First Data, our Wagmer Jack Welch Leadership Institute, Entrepreneur, Governance Now, and CNB.